Recent rainfall, rainfall has left parts of the Tampa Bay area completely saturated. Tonight, the Southwest Florida Water Management District has mobilized staffers to monitor water, water levels in lakes and rivers across our area. Eight on your side, investigative reporter Masa Saidi is along the Tampa Bypass Canal tonight. That's one of the major water control structures in our area. Well, hey guys, you can see that the orange cones are up behind me to stop any traffic from boats. And over here, you can see there's two gates. They are partially down to stop potential floodwaters. This system has diverted billions of gallons of water in the past, saving countless homes in our area. The predictions right now are, are at the point where we think we can handle them in this part of our area. However, it wouldn't take much change in that track to put a lot of rain here. So we prepare uh, for the worst and hope for the best. Tonight, officials with the Southwest Florida Water Management District are getting ready for whatever Dorian may bring. They're at a partial activation tonight. The Tampa Bypass Canal is known as a critical water control structure, but the district monitors and maintains about 80 other similar structures. Leading up to Dorian, they've ensured all the gates are functioning properly and the emergency generators are working and fully fueled. And the Hillsborough River is not a major concern tonight, but district officials are monitoring other bodies of water. Now, we checked out some of those communities for ourselves. Coming up at 530, you're going to hear from residents there. In Hillsborough County, Mosasaiti, 8 on your side.